So as I'm editing the video, I realized I don't want you guys to limit this scent to Senkos. I used Senkos because I catch a ton of fish on Senkos, uh, a lot of different techniques, and um, you have to put them in the containers, so it takes up some space. If your favorite bait is a beaver, put it on a beaver. Uh, if your favorite bait is a fluke, soak a fluke. Uh, swim bait, soak a swim bait. Whatever you use a lot, that's what. Whatever you have confidence in, that's what you need to put in these boxes. Um, if you have something that the fish might hold on to extra long, like a beaver or a craw or something that you use all the time, definitely put that bait in there. All right. So I just didn't want you to think it was limited to Sankos. Use this scent on anything you want. This scent. I feel has given me the upper hand. And if you haven't watched my other video about three tips for the Senko, check it out because the one tip is super important. I do before I pack these Senkos away, all right? So I've got five or six different waterproof plano boxes. And this is where I store all my Senkos. If you look, you can see how wet they are, right? My scent consists of three products, and I'm gonna make it up right in front of you here. So this is two different versions of Echo Gear. Okay, and this is the original, and this is the UV. Years ago, when I started using this, I didn't know which one to use. And then I just started combining them and it works. So I write, as you could, I don't know if you could see, but I write half on one bottle. I take the thing off and I put half UV and half original. And this is what I use, okay? So I'm gonna take my Sanko box and I'm gonna take the half and I'm just gonna put it in. Now the next thing, usually, by the way, fill this box up and do the little tip that I showed you in the previous video, then put them in. Then I take this Nori's Bite Powder EBI and I sprinkle it on top. Then the last thing I do is I put this Bite Bass Liquid EBI. Also made by Nori's. Once again, it's pretty stinky. You don't have to put much. Now I'm gonna fill this thing up. I'm gonna show you the last little thing I do. All right, guys, now I got this thing filled up. I'm gonna close her up. As you can tell, this thing is not brand new. I've been using it for years and I just shake her up real good. And what you could do is after you run out of Senkos, there'll still be a good amount of juice in the bottom. And you just stretch more, just take more salt out of the Senkos like I showed you in the previous video and throw them in. Guys, I have smoked them on this. I've been using it for about three years and I'm telling you this 100% works. I outfish guys all the time with a Senko. I mean guys, right? Who's Everybody's throwing Senkos, right? This gives you an upper hand. I'm telling you, try it, let me know, and then you can thank me later.